Tommy from 1039 The Bear, hanging out with 12 Stones. I've got Paul, um, Aaron, and Eric with me. How you guys doing? Doing awesome. Uh, glad to be at Rock on the Range. Well, we're glad you're here. Now, you got a new album out coming called uh, Beneath the Scars. Uh, tell me a little bit about the title and some more about the album. Yeah, Beneath the Scars is kind of like uh, kind of going over our past decade of being in the band. We started this band in 2001, and uh, we're still somehow here, you know, and uh, it's, it's, it's kind of what it's about. You guys have been around a while. It's like, you know, with 12 Stones, you guys have something special planned for 12, 12, 12 this year? Yeah. This is your year. I know. It's just survival. I know, right? yeah. Isn't that we're the not thing? dying, right? Yeah, just just to make it <laughs> you got a week to live. <laughs> Party it down, you know. 12 now, uh, with the new album coming out, you know, I really liked Bulletproof and I really like Infected. I know you've got these other six songs. I've got the one demo, but I've already I've listened to them. I got them sent a while back. Uh, what are some of the other highlights you feel it's going to be uh, we can look forward to in the record? Um, for this record, we kind of pulled out all the stops. We really tried to, like, not limit ourselves. Normally in our record, we try to, you know, put on the record what we can do live. And this one, we try not to limit ourselves to that. So it's definitely a different vibe from the other 12 Stones with the you know, normal core of what we've always done. So... Okay, now where'd you guys do this record at? It was in Nashville with Skid Mills, who did our third record. So, you know, we, uh, we're very familiar with him, and Nashville was such a great place to be, uh, to do a record, so we'd definitely go back. Okay, now when you guys are doing a record, and, you know, say uh, Eric's uh, tracking a lead, you know, what do you guys are doing when he's like working or something like that? I mean, what do you guys do to kill time? Are you guys always all there? Or do you guys track it individually? Yeah, we're usually all there. Um, we kind of zone out. Words with friends, Angry Birds, all the I was good gonna stuff. Just say computer gaming, some laptop gaming, that kind of. Thing. Any sports fans in the band? All of us, yeah, die hard. I mean, pretty much. Who are you into? Uh, we're from New Orleans, so we're the Saints fans, you know. Uh, I'm a huge, huge Pink Pittsburgh Penguins fan. About 20 years now. So. Oh yeah, Saints. All the way, no other things. Uh, you guys had a talk with that coach down there? <laughs> yeah, I think he got enough talking to. We're going to try to uh, <laughs> not remember those days, but we'll be fine. You're going to get Drew Brees locked in, and we'll be good to go. You're going to have a good year. Well, um, as far as touring and stuff like that goes, what do you guys, you know, this is a big day for you guys. Uh, what's, what's your summer going to be looking like? Hopefully busy. Right now we're trying to work a few different things out. We have a couple different options we're trying to make happen, but, uh, you know, trying to stay busy with the festivals and just keep moving, you know, that's the, that's the key. Idle time is not good for guys like us, you know. Okay. Now, I say when you get a break from it all, though, you know, what is that one thing you like to do that makes you feel like you're at home? Sleep. It's usually the first thing is you sleep for a really long time, and then you take advantage of your bathroom, bathroom. for a really long time. I was yeah. going to say the bathroom. Yeah, I just, I just hang out in the bathroom for a bathroom. while. <laughs> a couple <of> days. <laughs> Okay, well, you guys, um, you guys got a you know, kind of a, a big album coming out here. What are your, um, as far as, as other songs in the record? I know we've got Bulletproof, we've got Infected. There was a third song that I saw floating around. Um, really, what's that song you feel that's going to, you know, take this thing to the next level for you? Um, there's a lot of really good ones. Uh, I, I really like the song That Changes Everything. It's a little bit on the a lighter side of songs, but. Uh, uh, it's one of those songs we've had kind of on the back burner for a while. We finally got to make it happen, and I'm really looking forward to that one. Okay, going back to when you guys were first coming out as musicians, maybe not together, but individually, first band name. Oh, wow. First band name was actually Audience of One, appropriately named. What about you? Mosaic with a Z. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, I was in a band called Midway. That was it. Pretty simple. All right. Well, hey, these guys from 12 Stones, they got a new record coming out called Beneath the Scars. Get it. These guys are a really good band. And I tell you, I hate when great records like this come out and, and people ignore them. Don't ignore this record. There's some really good stuff on here. So please get the record. And guys, I so appreciate the time you guys taking out. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Appreciate it.